an example of typical disruption at compass tokamak. Disruption is an uncontrolled loss of magnetic confinement, which means discharge termination. It starts usually with uh, magnetic instability, like you can see, for instance, in this uh, graph from internal partial uh, Rogowski coil, which is located here in the mid plane, and at the end of the discharge, you see some magnetic oscillations. At the same time, plasma uh, moves towards the wall, as you can see in a fit reconstruction of uh, magnetic flux surfaces in colloidal cross section, in this case, plasma moves down. At the same time, we lose density. Soft X ray reconstruction shows that we lose whole thermal energy. Uh, also, we lose suddenly whole plasma current. And at the same time, as this blue curve shows, vessel currents start to increase. And I would like to point out that all this happens at a very short time scale, which is in case of compass, uh, is about just one millisecond. If you put this in a schematic uh, picture, uh, this is an example for uh, ITER expected disruptions, that would be the following. So we have normal operation in case of ITER like 400 seconds. And then a precursor event, which is characterized by edge cooling and therefore steeping of a current density profile in order to maintain plasma current. And uh, this uh, unstable uh, current density profile means we have almost uh, no current flowing outside uh, of uh, Q equals to rational flux surface. We have steep gradient uh, at the surface Q equals two, and in the center, it's a flattened profile. And uh, resonant flux surfaces will be affected by a steep current gradient, and they will become unstable. This will lead uh, to formation of magnetic islands. Then thermal quench starts. During thermal quench, the instabilities uh, that uh, have started um, during precursor phase, they will rapidly grow and the islands will overlap in radial direction. Uh, perpendicular heat diffusivity will increase, it will be much larger than normally, and we will lose thermal insulation. And therefore, we will suddenly lose our thermal energy. Uh, at this moment, temperature drops, and uh, temperature drop is followed by a uh, resistivity increase. Uh, to keep plasma, plasma currents, we will need to increase the voltage, but present transformer, transformers, uh, they cannot produce uh, the loop voltage uh, high enough uh, to um, maintain uh, the plasma current that we're losing. So we come to current quench, sudden loss of plasma current, which is accompanied by formation of uh, runaway electrons, induction of currents in the vessel, and uh, movement uh, of the plasma towards the wall, and this is disruption. Mm -hmm.